If you're locked out of your iPhone or you can't remember your passcode, you could actually enter recovering mode and restore your device to factory settings. And this works for every iPhone. And if you've backed up your phone using iCloud, which most people have, or if they backed it up to a computer, you could use that backup to restore your iPhone after the reset. So you just need two things. You need access to a Mac or PC, a computer. This requires a computer connection. And you need your cable, the same cable you use to charge your phone. You'll need to use that to connect it to the computer. First thing is you have to turn off your phone completely. So in this case, I'm going to hold these two buttons at the same time to restart my phone. Some other phones require a different process for a restart, but it's pretty much holding down a couple of buttons here. And I'll go ahead and slide on this page to turn off power. We have to do this first. Now, at this point, it depends on what phone you have and what button you should press. On the iPhone 8, 8 Plus, iPhone 10 or later, you have to hold the button on the right side. And while you're holding it, don't let go, connect your cable, your lightning cable, your charger cable to the phone. For a few seconds, you'll see the Apple logo. And then as long as you're holding the side button on the right, you'll see a recovery page. And if you do see this page and you're connected to the computer, you'll see an option on the computer to recover your phone. Before I show you that, on the iPhone 7, you'll have to hold the volume down button on the left side while you plug in your cord. And for iPhone 6 and earlier, you have to hold down the home button right in the center of the phone and plug in at the same time. Now let's jump into the computer to see how to reset to factory settings. Now, let me show you what happens if you connect to a Mac, and then I'll show you what happens if you connect to a PC. On a Mac, as long as your phone is connected and you saw that recovery page on your phone, you'll see this window pop up. This is just happening right inside of the Finder window. So my iPhone here showed up right over here on the side, and this popped up by itself. Now, Restore is going to wipe everything. You're going to lose everything on your phone. So make sure you log into iCloud.com to make sure you have a backup or if you use your computer to backup, make sure you have a latest backup there. Because if you do this, you'll have to recover everything from your backup. Now, if you're using PC, for example, I'm on Windows 10 here. Or if you're using an older operating system on a Mac, you'll need to have iTunes installed on that device, on that computer. So iTunes will open up here and you'll get the same exact window where you have to press restore and again you will lose everything on that phone and you will have to again use iCloud or iTunes depending on how you backed up your iPhone to restore everything back to the phone after you reset it but you'll be able to set a new passcode so if you forgot your passcode this is the way around resetting it. I hope you found this video useful Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow tech videos and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.